All right, so welcome back to another lesson of our class, where we will discuss about crafting um, simple prompts. Uh, we will go really fast through uh, the structures we have already learned, and we will see how can we craft these simple prompts. Uh, so, without any further ado, let's go ahead and let's type in our first prompt. Um, so, I will start with a simple and open-ended prompt. Alright, uh, let me see what can I do here. So, um, our open-ended simple prompt will look something like this. Uh, can you tell me, So, or just tell me, um a trivial fact uh about something few people know about let's hit enter did you know that honey never spoils archaeologists have discovered pots of honey in ancient egyptian tombs that are over three thousand years old and it is still edible huh interesting <clears throat> so this is an example of a simple and open-ended prompt. It allowed ChatGPT to, provi to provide me with an example it wanted. Uh, let's go ahead and ask ChatGPT for something else. This time we will use a closed-ended simple prompt. Um, what is the capital of France? I will hit enter and I will get this answer. The capital of France is Paris. So I got this answer from this closed uh, ended simple prompt. Sometimes ChatGPT might provide you with more information than you actually ask for. That's okay. But this is still a closed ended simple prompt because it's it doesn't have details that would change the outcome too much or I mean First of all, this is a closed prompt because it's a fact that the capital of France is Paris and ChatGPT doesn't have much uh, creative freedom here. And about here, it's also a simple prompt because it doesn't have many details. Now, that's it. Not too much to talk about here. This is it for crafting simple prompts. Uh, see you in the next lesson where we will discuss about crafting complex prompts.